counter offers. It's always flattering to know that you're wanted, but I guess that's the point of them. Make someone feel wanted to avoid the pain of replacing them. But what do the statistics say? Are they a good career move or a poison chalice? Figures vary considerably, but there definitely seems to be a consensus on counter offers, and that is in the majority of cases, the employee ends up leaving anyway. But what impact does this have on your career? The answer on this one ultimately comes down to missed opportunity. If you're more likely to leave a job shortly after a counter offer anyway, you've wasted six to 12 months extra spent in a job where you could have been pushing forward in a new role. And not only that, you've missed out on opportunity that you were clearly really interested in. Of course, it might work, but it's a gamble in which the odds are stacked against you.